Hey everybody, I'm Michael Posnick with Century 21 Northumberland. Welcome to my not so weekly weekly update about Prince Edward Island real estate as I stand in the forest here at Hiding from Society. You'll have to forgive me if I refer to some notes. So what's going on with the market? The market is awesome and September is awesome. It's almost 25 degrees today. It's at the end of September. I think our September was nicer than our August. Uh, the market lulled a little bit as it usually does for back to school and then picked right up afterwards. So things are great. We've got an abundance of buyers and the buyers surprisingly enough, and surprisingly enough are really stretching the envelope on the price range they're looking at. I'm seeing more and more eight, nine hundred thousand million dollar plus buyers and that's, a, that's an inventory typically we couldn't give away. So if you or anybody you know has something that's a million bucks plus or minus, now is probably a really good time to put that on the market. So that's what's happening with that um, listed. Actually, we'll get into solds. So we, we listed 152 uh, Heritage Road, Heritage River Road in Mermaid, which is just near Stratford across the Hillsborough River from Charlottetown. And that was on for 1.25 mil. We now have that under contract. We have an accepted offer. Uh, in addition to that, we have a house coming up in Charlottetown on Mount Edward Road. That's uh, gonna be amazing. Three beds, uh, one and a half baths for under 350. Super clean, been renovated from top to bottom over the last five years. Looks, feels like a brand new home. Got a split entry coming up in uh, East Royalty Sherwood area uh, with the detached double car garage super clean for under 450 Canadian and some at seven cemetery road there's been talk of offers coming in on that house I'm surprised it hasn't sold that's a really really nice bungalow on almost an acre and a half 3,000 square feet on two levels mint condition looks has water views it has a view of the golf course in New Glasgow and what else? There is a house centrally located that's going to be coming on the market soon. It is a bungalow on one level. Extremely well done. It's being ran as sort of an Airbnb rental. So he's got the house, he's got a detached garage which is turned into an apartment. It brings in some pretty tremendous revenue. You could live in the house, rent out the apartment. So that should be coming up at some point. And now is the time of the year to address the same question everybody has as I look through properties. Everyone's now talking about waiting until the spring. Waiting until the spring is probably the biggest mistake you could ever do because everybody waits until the spring. And the challenge from a marketing standpoint is we're into May, June, July before we can even get any decent pictures and video done. So even if you're going to list in the spring, get your marketing materials done now and go on in early spring, you'll probably end up with more money. If you list now, you'll probably end up with more money. It may take longer to sell, but you'll end up with more money statistically because there's a shortage of inventory and there is a surplus of buyers. It's a seller's market. In other words, the demand outseeds the supply. So if you're thinking about selling, list now. You can control the closing date. You can sell now. You can close in the spring, give yourself lots of time. But don't wait until the spring. Uh, and if you do, again, get the pictures and the video done now and then have a tentative listing date sometime in March. You'll probably be the only one on the market uh, in your category and probably end up with some more money. So that is about it for now. I, uh, I'm just here in Sunbury Cove Estates in St. Nicholas. If you haven't checked it out, we're opening up phase two. Phase one, which was developed in 2006 is pretty well sold. Waterfront and water view lots are pretty well gone. So we've just opened up uh, phase two. The gravel roads were just put in like yesterday. In fact, I, th I think they're just finishing uh, completing that today. Electricity is on its way. So if you're looking for some beautiful waterfront and water view lots with the potential to have a builder provide you with any house of your choosing, uh, completely turnkey. I mean, we can even take it to the point where we can get a decorator to do the furnishings, the appliances. All you need to do is open the front door and move in. So keep in mind Sunbury Cove Estates Phase 2 is opening. There will be tons of new video from my new drone uh, that I just added to the fleet within the next few days. Have yourself a great day. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and press the little bell symbol beside it. And as usual, if you have any questions about Prince Edward Island in general, 
I'm from away. I can probably give you an off-island perspective. Uh, if you have any questions about real estate in general or PEI real estate, put them in the comments below and enjoy your day.